welcome to the Relocation Agent Network National Property Market Review for the month of August 2022. And here's what's been happening across the national marketplace. The Bank of England have raised interest rates to 1.75% its sixth consecutive rise, warning that inflation could hit 13%. Out there in the market, however, according to Rightmove, the sentiment still seems to be quite strong. And currently there are more than 500,000 homes that are currently sold subject to contract, which is 44% higher than 2019. At £283,496, the average price of a property in the UK is now 12.8% higher than a year ago. The UK is currently dealing with historic temperature highs and although the scorching heat of the housing market is showing some signs of moderating as month-on-month -month price increases soften, it remains sunny for those looking to buy and sell. Rightmove reports that buyer demand is 26% stronger than in pre-pandemic June 2019, with the volume of new sellers to the market up 13% compared to this time last year. With the volume of new instructions still failing to keep track with demand, properties continue to sell in just 32 days. This is six days faster than a year ago and over three weeks quicker than the pre-pandemic June average. And whilst the cost of living crisis is likely to dampen the market over the second half of 2022, a net balance of agents still anticipate price growth over the next 12 months, according to the RICS. And in other news from the Treasury, after the 30th of September 2022, paper £20 and £50 notes will no longer be legal tender in the UK. At the last count, the Bank of England estimated that there were over 460 million unspent paper notes, over £600 billion unspent in 20s and £8 billion in 50s. At £14 billion, the value of unspent paper notes equates to the equivalent of over 50,000 average-priced homes. There are less than three months left for first-time buyers to benefit from the Help to Buy Equity Loan Scheme. The deadline for new applications is 6pm on the 31st of October 2022. The Equity Loan Scheme has helped over 300,000 first-time buyers take a step onto the housing ladder since it was first introduced in April of 2014. Unsurprisingly, the scheme was most popular in areas with higher house prices. 18% of the loans were in the southeast, compared to only 6% in the northeast. The scheme is only available on new build homes, and over 60% of new build homes built in southeast, southwest and the east of England were priced at a level that would qualify for the scheme, encouraging many first-time buyers to seize the moment. And in the rental market, there is news that Rightmove have revised their rental price forecast upwards. Average rents are likely to rise 8% over 2022, up from the previous forecast of 5%. Asking rents increased by 3.5% in quarter two, as demand continues to outstrip supply. The common tenancy length is now over two years, with 18% of landlords saying their average length of tenancy has increased over the past year, according to new research by Rightmove. Many renters are choosing to stay to avoid facing significant rent rises when moving. We hope that you found this report helpful and that you've enjoyed listening to what's happening across the marketplace in the UK. As ever, if you'd like more local information as to what's happening in your area, please get in touch with your local Relocation Agent Network member who will be happy to help. Thank you for watching.